cola. Everybody loves it, some of us don't, and that's okay. But it's a wondrous drink made from like corn syrup or something, or sometimes cane sugar or whatever. And it looks well, it's brown. And we like brown drinks here. But what if it had a replica? Yes, we have a diet coke. It's a regular cola. Well, I say like cola, not coke, but you know, because that's brand names and whatnot. But yes, today we have two different variants of the same thing from a company I haven't reviewed yet. Uh, if you might have seen a previous video, we did the Vive Cola, which is the Audi brand cola, because Audi has to be weird and go, oh, give out things fake brand names for some reason. This is the Coca Cola. Years ago I had something like this, the Coca Cola, but it tasted very much gingerbready, that was quite nice in a weird kind of way, it didn't taste like cola. But now it's back! Um, I say back, it's the first time I'm doing it on video. Because uh, I didn't do food reviews back then. It was mostly just shitty card game stuff and that one weird Pokemon video you don't talk about. Anyway, yes. We're going to be tasting both of these and seeing what they're like. And mostly probably being like, oh, I don't like diet drinks! Anyway, yes. Right, this is the regular cola we have here, the regular version. Let's have it and taste and see if it still tastes like gingerbread. Mmm. It's quite good. Mmm. It's quite, it's still got a quite shallow flavour from cola. I don't know how else to describe it. It's kind of sort of watery. I mean, obviously it's watery, it's liquid. But it's not like Coca-Cola where it has sort of like... It does it feels... It feels like it's been watered down. However, the thing is with this, which sets it apart from the, the Vive one, I think, is it has a bit of pep to it. It's got that bit of pep in the background, a bit of a sort of peppery, a bit of spiciness. A bit, a bit spicy in it, Hammond. Um, there's a bit of a spicy one. I like this. Hmm, yes. Well, uh, we'll set this one aside for a second. We'll get into a second cup. And we'll try the, uh, the, the diet. See, see what the dietness does to this. Well, that's the diet one. It's virtually indistinguishable. Virtually. In the regular. Colorized, it looks exactly the same. However... Hang on. Gone. It's not as peppy. What the heck? And again, that sort of weird artificial sweetness there. Yeah, this just does, it just has a lot of flatter flavour. I guess because of lack of sugar. <laughs> and that sort of artificial sweetness, which I don't tend to like in diet drinks. Mm. I mean, it's okay, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't choose this over this. Now, this is, I was gonna say, this is fine, but I like this. And on that bombshell, it's time to win. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, I give this a 6 out of 10, and this a, weirdly enough, a 9. Considering it's like a basic bitch cola. It's fine, actually. It's not. It, it's not necessarily competing with the, the big brands, but I don't think it needs to. To be honest, just need to compete with the other sort of cheap stuff. This is fine. I like this. Is it disappointing? It's not gingerbready. Little bit. Little bit. I want my gingerbread drink back. But oh well. See you guys soon. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and sub, and we'll catch you in the next one. Bye bye for now.